Hey guys, Celtic Fire here, back in another part in The Walking Dead. In the last part, somebody was walking up to our fort, and in this part we're going to see who it is! I told you. Shit, where'd this string come from? Watch where you're walking, man. Who are those people? I have a TV on in the background, I'm sorry. Are they the people that raided your camp? I don't think so, but they all had their faces covered, so I don't know. There's just two of them. We need to make a stand. Get him, Kenny. No, we have a routine. Don't confront them if we don't have to. You all right? Get him, Mark. Yeah, just getting untangled. I don't know how you're still alive, man. Sorry, Lily. <laughs> we gotta do this. That's far enough. Oh, shit. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, no problem. Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. It could be anywhere. But, uh, I think you got the upper hand here. What do you need gas for? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Oh, Larry likes it. Our generators run on gas. Look, Whoa, really? we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? Food. We got plenty at the dairy. I'm doing our food. Hey, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'll go too. Improve the numbers in case we run into anything dead. Yeah, Doug. So, uh, what do y'all think? You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Good Sounds deal. fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. Woo! Let's go see this dairy. So, yeah. this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but if we still have lots of food. If you can hear the TV in the background, I apologize. I kind of want to listen to some grow, sports talk after the game yesterday. I'm a huge Packers fan. I don't want to talk road. about it. Sure. I'd like to get a look at that electric fence they talked about. Might give me some ideas for something Just I can say I'm wearing look. Packer stuff because really we won. Well, as long as the Anybody who says otherwise is stupid. Views. Yeah, it seems plausible. The electricity basically cooks you from the inside out, right? I guess so. So, if a walker stays in contact with the fence, it'll eventually cook its brain. Probably takes a while, though. That can't be a good smell. Unless it smells like jerky. Go for some jerky. Hmm. What's that you got there? Oh, nothing. Just a laser pointer I picked up during our last trip to the drugstore. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Yeah. Where are you from? Where am I from? I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of John. That's what I like to hear. Oh, yeah. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor in. Who's running things over there? <clears throat> we work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. Mm, two spots. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. Getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. <coughs> cool, Ben. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for as long as I can remember, but now it's... Getting... You think you're going to cut me out of this? Oh, no. Shut it down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Mm -hmm. Jerry, you're always fucking the bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided my camp. Uh, who are they? Fuck you. Fuck you. You knew yes, we were hungry. Really and you guys were keeping it all for yourself. What should we do? Yeah, and you know what? Shoot them. What do you want to do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens, but let's just wait this out. I hope they move on. Why are you? Fuck you! Well, how about that? Fuck you! Fuck you! Oh, well, they definitely shot him in the head, so I don't think he's coming back. <laughs> the world out here is going to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. How about that? Okay. <laughs> Crazy people in this world. 
Yeah, we made it to the dairy. Yeah. That's why I like to hear you. TV said, "Yeah." Not even be able to see the TV. I don't know. I don't know where I'm exactly angled in the room here. Fence keeps them out. You betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're yeah, buddy. Four thousand volts through that thing. Generators and amps. Oh wow. You guys must know a thing or two about running wire. Had a guy who did, yeah. Ever have any accidents? Nah, it's safer here than out there. Oh, wow, you've got enough electricity to run the whole place. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Oh, Hi, yeah. This is our mom. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow on good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh, my goodness. That place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Who just asks that question? <laughs> together plus we've got plenty of people with military experience well that's good to hear who that just goes so yeah if I who has leadership experience mm -hmm. does that offer apply to the rest of us we're starved these are for y'all they fresh this morning holy moly <laughs> God damn it, Doug. Sorry. <laughs> you stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Mm -hmm. Your cow is sick? What she... We have a vet. But we could bring her here. But we can help you folks out. Gosh. A vet? Darn it, oh, Mark. Mark. Our prayers have been answered. Maybe our whole group could come. No. For the day. Bad idea, Mark. I don't like that idea. Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. Mm. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip back here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. No problem. Ben can come. Take <laughs> this. All right. See you later. Yes, that's who I would choose to take back with me. Ben! Mark, leave you. Why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. Okay. That's it. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence. Oh, man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously, they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Oh. Maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see. And checking the fence perimeter sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right. Yeah, you gotta leave. my eyes open. And you find out what you can from Andy. Let's go talk to Andy, I guess. All right. Andy, I need to come talk to you. Andy, let me talk. Gotta talk to you, buddy. Right. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? We've scraped together a good supply in the last few months. How about yourselves? What kind of protection do you have around here? We collected a few guns to protect ourselves, but we really only use them when we go off the property. When we're inside the perimeter, the fence is all we need to keep us safe. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on. 
looking for the people they lost contact with. Whatever. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers. Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> uh, the old ones wouldn't have, but Mac, he was hmm. our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here don't... some nights and watch the sons of bitches yeah. sizzling and pop when they got too close. Okay, whatever. The closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots. We gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. Mm hmm Like us? Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm gonna go fix that perimeter. Well, I, mean, I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. Fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. Mm -hmm. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Okay. Now let's actually go do something. Yeah. 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 All right. We're welcome with Mark. Gonna have some bromance time. How's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? We can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. Mm -hmm. It wouldn't be such a pain in the ass if you weren't telling him we were talking behind his back all the time. I, I'm, I'm sorry, all right? Yeah, Mark. I try to be civil at least. Yeah. He's too busy being. Mmm, yummy. There's one. Ugh. <laughs> well, it's definitely dead. It, Wait, it got shot through dead. the head. Yeah. Come on, let's push it off. Yep, push her off. No, oh, that like arrow. That arrow got stuck in there. Ew. It's gross. Grody. Alright, now let's push it off. Mm -hmm. Come on. Yummy. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? That would be amazing. The fortress needs people to defend it. We've got enough people. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. Thanks, Mark. Thanks. There's another one. Aren't you a... I see it. Bro. <laughs> I don't know what else to call you. Alright, let's push you off now. Mmm, yummy. Oh, no, no. Oh, no. I guess we had. Yeah. Yeah. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Hmm. I can only imagine. Christ! I can't stop thinking about dinner. Me Would neither. Would have been nice to get some of those rations. Mm. I get hungry too, you know. I'm hungry too, Mark. Yeah, I didn't eat either, didn't Mark. Eat before? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Come on. I think I see where they're getting in. Me this too. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we get better <laughs> Mr. Crispy. from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> Let's go get Mr. Crispy off. <laughs> There we go. Push, 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 push. Q, 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 Q. Yeah, I love Q. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Yeah. Oh, Mark! What the? Get to the gate! Mark! Got a shit. Who the 
Alright. Well, I guess let's push it along with us. And, oh, it looks like it's stuck in the back. So let's look at the back here. Ah, that is why. Let's lift that baby up. Oh. Alright, is there anything over here I need to worry about? Alright, yes, that thing's in the way. Get that shock out. Alright, let's just follow. I'm sure that arrow hurts, Mark. But we'll get back. I promise. We can do it, we can do it. Oh yeah, oh yeah, mm, we can do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Oh. One of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move. Oh goodness. Let's move. Oh, okay, I guess we'll move you. Get you out of the way. Pull you out. Hey, okay. That was probably the one with the arrow in it. So didn't have to worry about it being fake dead. Because <laughs> uh. another one. How many of those things did we push down? We only pushed out three, so here's the here's the second one. Excuse me, sir. I'm gonna need to ask you to move. Oh no! No 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 no! Uh, punch him! Kick him! Do something! Oh, gross! Oh, that's gross! Go! 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 Oh no. He's coming! Oh no. Oh no. Okay, come on. Come on. Mark! Tractor! Go faster! Oh, nice shot. Let's get out of here. I agree. Shut the gate behind you, Lee. Why didn't you shut the gate behind you? You're a smart one. Danny or Andy should consider. I thought this place was safe. Holy shit! Are, are you okay? No, I just have an arrow. I know. They have no right being out here. Oh my lord! Oh my lord! You have any people with leadership experience in your group? <laughs> Mark, oh, hey. oh my god, what happened? You got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you going to be okay? Yeah, <laughs> I'm fine. I should just pull it out. Oh no, mm, honey. Yeah, Come probably. On. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Mm. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? Shut up, Larry. There's some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about mm. these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. Interesting. God damn it! Doug said this place was safe. Oh, uh, you can never trust Dougie. So much for your deal. Those shitheads broke the agreement. Look, I'm hmm. sorry, Lee. If I had any inkling they were going to give you guys trouble, well, we would have gone out there with you. Listen, we may have had an agreement mm. with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no, no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. Yeah. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Oh. We'll go scope it out. Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think mm. all of us in our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. <laughs> what we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Oh, Kenny. Oh, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before <gasps> we eat. Larry, you made a reasonable <laughs> conjecture. I am proud of you. <laughs> well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah. <laughs> That's real charming. <laughs> Where's Ben and Doug? Oh, Since Larry. Doug ate half the biscuits on the way to get us, I had them stay back. I still don't think we should be trying to stay here. And someone's got to watch the motor in until we get back. 
Well, that's good job, Doug. Hey, uh, Why I they... remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed Why were they that talking? You were I don't like that. Your kids like swings. I swing. Oh, I love no. swings. Just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Ducky and his... kids go and play on the swing. Huh? Duck in your derpy yeah. face. <laughs> yeah, let's hey, go Doc, swing. We're looking out for you. Clemmy, I am going to go swing with you. We're going to be an amazing duo. Duck, get the F off the there. Kenny, it is not yours. Clemmy! Hey, Clem, do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Good. I'm going to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Will you Good push girl. me on it? Of course. Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. Yeah, duck. Okay, I'm going. I need to take the whole time. Push. What do you think of the dare? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. <laughs> do you think things will ever get back to how they were? Let's be optimistic. I say that. Yeah. I'm not sure when. One day. Things Got to get that. That's good. I hope it's soon. Yeah, me, me too, too. Clammy. How are you doing? How are you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? And lucky out there. It'll have been a lot hmm. worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Yes. Then we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky too. Since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. Ah. Uh, Alright, Clemmy, I'm gonna have to stop here. Alright, Clem, that's enough for now. Okay, thanks for pushing me. No problem, it's Clemmy. It's all yours. Yeah! Okay. I think that's a good enough, a good spot it. to stop, though. So, if you like this part, I'd appreciate a like. Any thoughts, comments, concerns, and complaints, leave them down below in the comment box. Otherwise, have a good day.